They call themselves street artists, but most people call them vandals, and the city's top brass calls them idiots. Now we found video that shows taggers getting little kids mixed up in their life of crime. News 13's Alex Tomlin has the videos. Taggers spray painting their names and logos across the city is nothing new, but seeing these little kids along for the ride is a whole different story. It makes you angry. It's, you know, it's glorifying criminal behavior. And it's ticked off Public Safety Director Darren White. The message that that sends, you know, hey, it's cool if you're seven or eight years old and you want to long to grow up to be a tagger. No, actually what you're saying to that kid is you long to grow up to be a criminal who's going to be behind bars. The video, which is broken up into four parts and posted on the web, mainly shows what looks like teens or young men playing the graffiti game. Today we found some of their handiwork from the videos in the South Valley. You know, it's not artistic, it's trash. They think they're cool, they're idiots. Um, because it's, it's criminal behavior and it makes our city look bad. Pictures posted online also show drugs. White says cops will look at the videos and try and figure out who's hiding behind the bandanas. White says he also wants to find out just whose kids these are. If this was the children of wh whoever was making the video, they shouldn't be allowed to have kids, uh, let alone a spray can. Alex Tomlin, KRQE News 13. The city, as in taxpayers, spends hundreds of thousands of dollars every year cleaning up